Hey, what's up guys? This is Bert from Soft Tubes and it's another trailer reaction. This is basically a week of trailer reactions and today we actually, instead of having to catch up on one, there's a new one! Sonic the Hedgehog. I did a video about the reveal of his look. I don't know if I'm a fan still, but this trailer might change my thoughts, so let's just jump on into this. Uh, what? Gotta go fast. Twenty minutes ago, an energy surge knocked out power across the entire Pacific Northwest. What? We need someone who can figure out exactly what we're dealing with. You're not suggesting who I think you're suggesting. Uh. We have no choice. Hmm. What the? Are you in charge here? Yes, I am. No. My wrong. I'm in charge. Allow me to clarify. In a sequentially ranked hierarchy based on level of critical importance, the disparity between us is too vast to quantify. Agent Stump? The doctor thinks you're basic. Listen, pal, I don't know if you realize who... I'm sorry, Major. What was your name? Benny. Nobody cares! SFPD! Uh... Whoa. Meow? Come on. Okay, pal, I want answers. Basically, it looks like I'm gonna have to save your planet. Oh, is that all you got? No, but thank you for asking. Uh-oh. Whatever this creature is, our job is to secure it, neutralize it, see what makes it tick. Nine million steps today. Stay in there and be quiet. How much longer? I can't breathe in here. Do you have your child in that bag? No. I mean, yes, it's a child, but it's not mine. It's not your child. It smells like body spray in an old ham sandwich. What? Okay. 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 I'm gonna... Okay. So that was a thing. That was a thing. I. Mm. I, uh, I don't know how to, I, straight up, Sonic, I could maybe buy the design, maybe, but it just looks bad, like the CGI does not look good, like, Pokemon, the, like, Pika Detective Pikachu still sort of stands out a little bit, and it's kind of understandable. But there's something about it that just looks like it blends. I, I think it's because of the world they put around it. Like, they may be the exact same level of quality of CGI, Sonic and Pikachu, but the world around them looks very different. The Pokemon world matches with the style of the Pokemon, so it's more believable when you see Pokemon living in that world. Sonic's in fucking modern day America. He stands out like all ass. And it makes the CGI that makes him up look more like ass. And that's just to begin with. The fact it's even set in modern day America, 
why was anyone like that? This is literally a movie that should have come out if it was ever going to come out early 2000s, late 90s. That's when this movie should have come out in the way it looks and the way it acts. That's when this movie was sub- should have come out. It would have done fine. We might not have thought it was great, but we would have been like, Yeah, okay, it's a thing. It's, it's alright, whatever. It was Sonic. Sonic got a movie, at least. There's no reason for this anymore. We've moved beyond this. Like, it annoys me just looking at the CGI. Does anyone remember that we just got Thanos? Thanos is a thing now. Look at Thanos, and like, yeah, it's not perfect. Doesn't 100% look real. But the muscles move in a certain way, and everything just sort of works in a real way. Making a cartoon guy that's supposed... And then, because he's the only character like that. Maybe if they had more, it'd be more viable. But it's just Sonic, and then... Everyone else is very real, except for Eggman. Dr. Robotnik, who's cartoonish in a Jim Carrey way, which I will say, I am not the biggest fan of Jim Carrey. Chris loves Jim Carrey. I find that he's sort of, in a way, it's similar to my feelings on Johnny Depp. I think he's sort of, and I don't think it's necessarily his fault. I think he's gotten caught in doing the same sort of thing over and over again. Not his fault, at least not entirely. He didn't choose necessarily to keep doing that. But that's what the roles he kept getting, and they kept wanting that. People like, we want Jim Carrey, so we want you to be Jim Carrey. And that's fine, except for the fact that, like, after a while, I'm just like, okay, I've seen Jim Carrey be Jim Carrey. It's part of the reason I love uh, one of my favorite, um, G- my favorite Jim Carrey movie, and one of my favorite like movies from when I was a kid was um, uh, Cable Guy, because. There's some things of him in there, but it's him doing something very different, and I love that. I love seeing actors who do one thing do something different, and this is just incredibly Jim Carrey. I don't know if there's a... I don't remember Dr. Robotnik's character very well, but that didn't feel like Dr. Robotnik, and that sucks because Jim Carrey is currently the thing I'm most interested in this film about. I'm actually kind of keen to see him be that character even if it isn't dr robotnik like fuck it i'll watch jim carrey act like that for however long i want him to win now and then they tease his like proper look like at the end of the trailer and i'm probably gonna be wrong but there's two ways i see that happening because i think it was in a desert and there was one shot of sonic in a desert so there's two things that are going to happen there. Either there's a lot of build-up, they think Robotnik's gone at some point in the film, and then he comes back bigger and badder in the desert, and that's when he has that look, the classic look. Or, what I feel is more likely, the movie ends, and then there's like either in an Amazing Spider-Man ty- uh, type way, Amazing Spider-Man 2, there's an a sequence... Leading up where it looks like there's going to be a big fight and then Robotnik comes out and he looks like Robotnik and he's got his army and he's like, we're going to fight. And then right before the action, it cuts and goes straight to credits. Or it'll just be a post credit scene of him looking like that to be like, look, if we do a sequel, we're going to get this. Except probably is they're never going to get a sequel. <sighs> Which is another reason it feels like a freaking movie that should have come out like 10, 20 years ago. It- Mm. I wanted to go in with positive vibes. I was already kind of tired and sort of like in a meh mood when I started this video. But nothing about that aside from Jim Carrey made me at all interested. I don't... Oh, and it sucks. I must say it because I'll, I'll end up reviewing it when it comes out. And what's with the song choice? Now I just clicked. It just sort of came into my head. Who the hell was like, we're doing a Sonic the Hedgehog movie? And they were like, yeah, that sounds cool. I guess, like, people still like him, I guess. Maybe. Where was the last time he had a successful video game? Who cares? Let's just make this movie. And I'm like, all right. So we're going to set it in modern day America. And they're like, of course. That's when all great things are set. And they're like, and we're going to play Gangster's Paradise over the trailer. Because... No song screams Sonic the Hedgehog like 
Gangster's Paradise. My phone is going off at the moment. I forgot to put it on silent. Who the hell picked that song? Mm. <laughs> there are so many odd choices. This isn't even a well-made trailer enough to excuse what they've shown. And that concerns me on so many levels. God, I wanted this to actually be good. There was part of me that was like, this might actually be good. I didn't really like the look of him, but... It'd be cool if we could get a good Sonic the Hedgehog movie. And then they gave us this. And I'm just miserable now. I don't even give a crap about Sonic. But I feel like if I liked Sonic, I would be so furious right now. Which is funny because it's the producers of Fast and Furious. A series that I'm actually starting to enjoy now that I think they know who they are. But now they're trying to make Sonic the Hedgehog Fast and Furious, and... Uh, I think they're also the producers doing Men in Black International. Which is weird, because that's another movie. I'm like, it knows what it is. It wants to be fun. This, I don't know if it knows what it is. I don't know. It's, um, it might still be fun. And maybe if they do a second trailer, that might be better. This was the introduction of the character of Sonic into the world they built. built. Since really all they did was they took two characters from Sonic and shoved them in America. And went, look, we built a world. Oh, they're going to try and explain Sonic's powers and everything and why he can talk and stuff. Because Robotnik was like, we need to find the thing. Oh my god, sharp phone. Uh, I don't know. You know what, guys? I'm just going to leave it here. Like, if you have some defense of this trailer, please let me read it. Maybe when I might come back and watch this trailer again when I'm in a bit of a better mood and I might actually enjoy it. So, I'm going to leave it, but you never know. Maybe this will actually work out better if I come back. But yeah, let me know what your thoughts are. If you like it or don't like it. Ah, that stupid chair. Um, and then, yeah. I mean, that's basically it. Just let me know what your thoughts are on this thing. If you're really excited for a Sonic movie. And if you're still excited. And uh, if you like this video, leave a like. And or um, you can even dislike it if you didn't like it. I mean, if, yeah, if you're a Sonic fan and you think this looks good and you don't agree with me, you can totally dislike this video. That's totally fair. I'd rather you didn't, but you can totally do that. It's your prerogative. And, uh, yeah, if you're new to the channel and you want to watch me... <sighs> Most of the time, I'm not this angry at trailers. I swear. Uh, I said maybe Angry Birds 2. That one I think I was pretty miserable at. But yeah, normally it's a bit nicer. So yeah, if you want to watch more of this, uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And if you want to make sure you're up to date every time one drops, hit the bell. I believe this is coming out on Thursday. There will probably be a bonus video later in on today. Um, if I get around to it. Or there'll be bonus videos tomorrow on Friday. Uh, so I look forward to all of that, and I will see you all in the next video. I'm driving. That really should be here. Oh, I love mm. this country. <laughs> yes. I'm so faded, no exaggeration. Shall we? I thought that we were here. Oh, we are. Okay. <laughs> Stefano, would you, Freddy? You go to H. <laughs> what happened here?